Welcome to this Blackpool Music School video all about the mandolin. In the last video you saw me play the mandolin in 4-4 four, four time. This video is in waltz time or 3-4. I'll be using the same chords G, C and D7 but this will give you another rhythm to play with. It's, there's many rhythms in music but 4-4 four, four and 3-4 four are probably the most common in European music and American music. So let's get started. We will use a G chord. This time we're going to pluck the individual G string there. So we go one, two, three. That would be one, two, three, one, two, three, one. When you go to a C chord, you still pluck that thick string there. One bar of D, one bar of C, two bars of G. And that's really all there is to the waltz drum in a basic pattern. There's a bit more to it which we'll add later on. So we'll now do 12 bar blues in a waltz rhythm. So there are four bars of G. One. That's the first bar. That's the second bar. That's the third bar. That's the fourth bar. Change to a C chord, same rhythm. One. Back to G. D chord. C chord. G chord twice. I will now play it through at normal speed. I will write the chords down below and it's one bar for each letter, that's all you need to remember. So we'll do it again, four bars of G. Two bars of C. Two bars of G. One bar of D. One bar of C. Two bars of G. The only thing you need to remember is you mustn't pause in between changing chords. You can't do... When you're counting one, two and three, you must keep that rhythm constant. So that's the basics of the waltz strum. There is one little bit more you can add which gives it a bit more swing and it goes like this. You do normal G chord, the one is there and you do two and three and. So it's one, two and three and. We'll do that again. Just a G chord up here. That, you put the thicker string there. Two and three and one, two and three. So to the 12 bar blues, it goes something like this. That'd be the first four bars in G, two bars of C. Back to G. One bar of D. Two, one, one bar of C, sorry, that's me. 
two bars of G. And at speed, at normal speed, Again together, so four bars of G. Two bars of C. Two bars of G. One bar of D. One bar of C. Two bars of G. Now a little bit of music theory for you here really. This is rhythm. Tempo is the speed you play it at. So you can play that really slow. One, two, and three, and one, two, and three, and, or fast. Rhythm is the count and the count one, two, three, four, or in this case one, two, three, and tempo is the speed you perform the piece at. So I hope you found this video useful. If you have, please subscribe to Blackpool Music School and follow us on Twitter and Facebook. All the links are in the description below. If you've enjoyed this video, please give us a thumbs up. And until next time, take care and goodbye.